Hi guys, this is that video 25 facts about me. So, here goes. I own a camper van called Charlie, let me show you him. He's appeared in a few of my videos. He is a Type 25 camper. Take nothing but air, leave nothing but oil. He's very, very cool. Just come back from a camping trip, that's why he's kind of a bit full of stuff. But he's ace, I love him to bits. He's 33 years old now and he's done about 158,000 miles. I can say the alphabet backwards as easily as I can say it forwards. ZYXWV UT SRQP ONML KJ IHG FE DC BA. There is a link in the description, guys, on how to learn that. It takes about two minutes. It's really, really easy. So that's on another video. I am, unfortunately, one of the messiest people in the world. Just how I am. I put it down to my creative side, which brings me on to the next one. I am an artist. And uh, I've done this in another video, which is... Um, like a time-lapse video so that's quite cool just a sharpie pen on a kind of ceramic pot which I'm going to glaze thought that's quite cool and uh, I'll also give you um, show you some pictures of my artwork as well I am absolutely terrified of spiders. I can cope now with, if I can get a spider kind of that big, that's not so bad, but any bigger, no. Mm. I love collecting wooden boxes. I'll show you. Anything wooden. I have a pretty cool Atom longboard, which I ride. As you might have gathered from the blindfold I was wearing earlier, I'm a scout leader. I've been a scout leader now for 22 years and I absolutely love it. It's the best unpaid job in the world. You don't get paid in money but you do get paid in the adventurous activities that you do. You know, you, we take the scouts gliding, rock climbing, summer camps. We went over to Brown Sea Island recently and stood in the place where the very first camp was held by Robert Baton Powell. So it, it's just, it's amazing. Yeah, it's fantastic. If you've got any free time, please give it a go. It is amazing. I'm allergic to tetanus toxide, so I'll wear this medical alert bracelet. And if anything happens to me, if I become unconscious or whatever, on the back it just says that. Can you see that, guys? It just says allergic to tetanus toxide. And uh, yeah, it happened when I was about 14 months old. I was rushed into hospital with uh, severe convulsions, had, had a temperature of like 107, which can quite often be fatal. And my parents were told if I lasted the night, then I stood a chance. And luckily I made it. And uh, yeah, they found out I was allergic to tetanus toxide. My friend Helen and I hiked up Snowdon at the Lamberis Pass at midnight to raise money for the Alzheimer's Society. Um, a neighbour of ours had that awful disease, it's terrible. And also, um, sadly, my auntie had that as well. And we just wanted to do something to kind of raise awareness of this disease. It was challenging at midnight to say the least, but we got to the top at quarter to three in the morning. We hiked back down and we saw the sunrise. It was absolutely amazing. And we were raising money for such a good cause as well. So there is a link in the description. It is one of my other videos, uh, so you can see how we got on. It's 
Yeah. Yeah. You're not going to be able to see much on my phone. Oh, Do you want to see on my phone? Time. Hang on a minute. Yeah. It's 2.45. My lucky number is seven. I'm not really sure why, to be honest, but it just seems to have been lucky for me. So I'm going to stick with it. I've been a fan of Noel Edmonds since 1975. Can't believe it. But he's still on TV now doing Deal or No Deal. I loved Noel's house party. And to be honest, I don't think there's anything on the TV on BBC One uh, between September and March that kind of beats that, to be honest. My favourite colours are red and purple and I'll have that kind of put in my hair quite soon and at the back as well so I'll show you guys that when I get that done. One of the most amazing things that I would love to photograph which I haven't managed to yet would be wild boar. That would be so cool to photograph those. I'm, I'm still trying to find some. I absolutely love the ocean, I love the seaside and I want to go bodyboarding but I can't swim yet so my kind of aim before next summer is to learn to swim. I absolutely love tattoos and I've got a half sleeve tattoo but before I show it you guys it's on you forever so you've got to be 18 to get tattooed Please think about it really carefully. If you can wait 10 years, that's great. If you can't, then pick a really good artist. Just choose what you want, you know, on you really carefully. Don't go with trends because they will change and then you'll wish you hadn't got that, whatever it was on you. You know, go for a custom tattooist so you can have the only design in the world like it. And, you know, just, just think carefully about what you're doing because it's something that I've thought about for about 25 years so it, it's not kind of something that I've decided in the last year or so and it's it's something that I love very much I'll show you guys my sleeve mm. Mm. one of my hobbies is short mat bowling And of course, I had to have purple bowls. One of my most favourite places to go to in Britain is Lampwich Major, which isn't far from Cardiff. And it is the most beautiful beach. I mean, yeah, there are the rocks, but at certain times on the low tide, there's a massive amount of sand. It's beautiful. There were four lifeguards on duty, so you, your kids were safe swimming. It was amazing, fantastic place. There was even a little cafe that does ace cook breakfasts and some toilets just there. So it, it's really easy, all accessible. And yeah, it's a brilliant place. If you've never been, try it out. Lambwich Major. brother no sisters I can remember when uh, I was about three or four I just all I wanted was a brother and I would say to my mum and take me down to the doctors and of course at the age of three and a bit I didn't really understand where babies came from or anything and I would say to the doctor have you made a bit more of my brother and he'd say yeah yeah I have yeah I've made his arm today I've made his leg today and I just really hoped and wanted a brother and, and thankfully my uh, dreams came true. My favourite food is eggs. Anyway, omelettes, fried eggs, poached eggs, hard boiled eggs with salad. I uh, just, I don't mind. I just love eggs. I absolutely love cycling. It's one of the 
best ways to get fit, really cool. Um, obviously be safe guys, wear a crash hat, but yeah, I love cycling. One of my other hobbies is doing magic, and uh, a little clip of uh, Magic Trick follows this guys. subscribe and uh, next video will be up soon. Cheers guys!